Hi folks, co-tutor here and my name is Anil Deshpande. Hi folks, welcome to the next video on extensions. In the previous video about extensions, we had discussed about how to declare a extension in a file and use it and import it in a, another part of the application. In this video, we will talk about how to use extension in a class. Now the question is, can you declare an extension in a class and what does it actually mean? Well, extensions in a class basically means extensions as a member functions. Let's assume that I have a class called as radio. This is pretty standard class with a function and then let me have a, another class called as car and this car class has a object of radio inside it. It uses a radio class or radio object. If I extend the radio class using the extensions in the car class then that's what we are talking about as extensions as member functions. Now the class radio which is getting extended in another class is called as extension receiver and the class in which we are defining the extension for another class which in this case is the car class is called as extension dispatcher. So enough of the theory let's do some coding and understand it through a demo. So let me create a class called radio and this will have a frequency which is of type string and let me declare a function here function play and what this thing will print is something like playing a particular fm frequency now let me create another class called as car this car has a radio and this car also has got a name let me create a function here print name that basically prints name of the car and now i can declare a extension function for the radio inside the car class so fun radio dot say audio details this is an extension function for the radio being declared in another class which is car class i can say print name which will print me the car name and then print colon and then i can invoke radio dot play and then declare uh, another function so show car audio details which basically invokes the extension function so now what i can do is i can create a car i will make a radio frequency some random number and say tata nexon and again execute show car audio details and if i run this you will observe that it is basically a combination of the function invocations from car class which contains the extension function which in turn might be calling a function from the another class so that's it about the extensions in kotlin in the next video we will meet with another topic that brings us to the end of this particular video. Don't forget to like, comment, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Take care. Bye.